Welcome everybody to Monday Night Raw. It's me. It's me. It's Dirty Deeds and we are live in the great city of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Where we have a hell of a show for you here tonight. As look at this is a man who's been putting on some really good matches lately against the likes of AJ Styles, Bray Wyatt, and his opponent tonight is Cesaro. Here we go. Chad Gable and Cesaro are looking looking the battle. And the matchup is underway, ladies and gentlemen. And look at this. Chad Gable has been proving himself to be one of the top competitors on Monday Night Raw. Oh. Oh, don't. Big back suplex to Cesaro. You might think that's it. One. Oh, Cesaro just kicked out. Oh, that arm drag from Cesaro. Or Cesaro can catch anybody. And here we go. Oh, big suplex. And now, Chad Gable. Oh, Cesaro with that big uppercut. One. Oh, only a one count. This is Monday Night Raw, ladies and gentlemen. Goldberg, Goldberg actually decided to let, to let, let me book the show. He said, okay, you know what? You can book the show for tonight because really, I don't care. So I actually booked this show tonight. So if it's good, it's because I booked it. And Cesaro. Oh my God. Oh, Cesaro. Cesaro is really powerful. And he's going for another one. Oh, another one. Ken Cesaro. Oh, that big uppercut. Oh. Oh, drop kick from Chad Gable. Chad Gable. Chad Gable's partner, Jason Jordan, has not been around for a while. I believe... It said that he's going to return to face Gable next week. And this is, that's only, but that's Goldberg. Because, you see, Goldberg still runs Monday Night Raw. He is like, you know what, since it's in, since it's in your hometown, I won't be a complete jackass. And I will let you book your own show. So, it, this is my show, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go. Oh, he's going for a triple. A triple. To... And Cesaro, what could he be going for? Oh, the big middle rope uppercut. One. Two. Oh. And here we go, Cesaro. Oh, look at that. Oh, reversal from Gable. Now, Gable, could he be going for it? Big. Oh, the arm burn. Oh, Gable let go of it. And now, Gable. Oh, Cesaro versus. Oh, and he throws Gable outside of the ring. And the referee starts to count. Oh. And Cesaro. Oh, bash in the face off the mouse table.
And he's picking up Gable. Oh, you shouldn't have done that, Cesaro. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Boo. Oh no. And Cesaro Cesaro caught him. Neutralizer. One, two. Oh, Gable kicked out. Gable was somehow able to kick out of the neutralizer. And now Cesaro's getting completely angry he was ready oh the big drop kick and Cesaro's not done with Gable oh he throws him up springboard uppercut one oh and Gable's able to stay is able to kick out. Cesaro is wondering what does he have to do. And he's calling on Gable. No, Gable. Gable fights out of it. Oh, the big punch. Oh. Oh, a punch to the back, and a big back suplex. This is Aro. One, two. Oh, Cesaro is able just to kick out. And you see Cesaro. Oh my God, he just scared Gable. And now, oh the uppercuts. Cesaro now going for the uppercuts. No. Gable counters. Oh, the big uppercut. One. Oh, two. Oh. I was actually two count, guys. Uh, on the screen, it said one of them was actually two. It, the game was kind of messed up. My bad. Oh, and Gable. Going for it. Straight jacket suplex. One. Two. Oh, Cesaro kicked out. What does Gable got to do? And now Gable heading up to that top rope. Oh, missed the elbow drop. And now you see Cesaro go up to the top rope. With an elbow drop of his own. One. Two. Oh, Gable kicked out. What does Cesaro got to do? These men are putting on an amazing matchup here on Monday Night Raw. Oh, that big gut red shoe flex. Oh, another one. And here comes a big third one. And now Cesaro. Oh God. Oh my goodness. Cesaro. He's picking up Gable. And he super play. Oh my God. The apron suplex. Here we go. Cover. One. Two. Oh. Gable kicked out again. What does Cesaro got to do? And now you see Gable. Gable fighting out of it in a German suplex. You see now. Oh, big belly to belly suplex.
And now he's going for it again. Arm break. Oh, no. The referee told him to break it up. I think because his headband was under the rope. And now you see Gable. Oh, Cesaro. Oh, no. Counters. Oh, the big forearm. Lifts his arm up. And a northern light suplex. One. Two. Oh, Cesaro was able to just kick out. And now you see Gable. Oh. And now Cesaro throws him into the ropes. And uh, oh, the big European uppercut. That's got to be all. That's got to be it. One, two. Oh, Gable kicked out again. These two are putting on a match of the year candidate. And now he's going for it. Neutralizer, no. Gable counters. And another straight jacket suplex to Cesaro. One, two. Oh, my God. These two men are putting on a match of the century. And now Gable. Gable looks to roll Cesaro up. One, two. Oh, and Cesaro is able to kick out. Oh, and you see him clothesline Cesaro out of the ring. And now you see Gable getting ready to go to that top rope. He's like he's waiting on Cesaro. And a, oh, big cannonball. And now a big, and now the arm breaker. Oh, but he realized that he's on the outside. You see Gable in the ring, waiting for Cesaro to get up. Will Cesaro get up or will he lose to the 10 count? You see... He is just dazed. And Cesaro. Oh, I thought he's going up the right. Oh, no. He's going back in. Woo! Oh. Oh, and another big European uppercut. And a third straight jacket suplex. If it took a third one, why not go for the pin? And now Gable calling on for Cesaro. Oh, and he missed him. And a big drop kick from Cesaro. That might be it. One, two. And again, Gable is able to, is not staying down. Gable. Oh, the big spinning elbow. Oh, no. Oh, no. And now Gable get a rest to the outside. Oh. And now Gable caught Cesaro and a roll up. Go for 
my cover. One, two. Oh my God! Cesaro kicked out again. What does Cesaro have? What does Gable have to do? Oh. Boo. Yeah. Boo. And now Cesaro. Oh, and Gable punches him. And the back suplex. And now you see Gable. Go for the jacket. No suplex, no reversal. And a German suplex of his own. And now he's going for another German suplex. Oh, Gable counters. And now Gable. Now Cesaro. He's got that sharpshooter locked in on Gable. And Gable, you see Gable, Gable, powering out of it, oh. Oh, the big clothesline. Oh, sent on. And, oh, Cesaro. These two men are carrying it over everywhere in the ACC. Oh, come on, Gable, get him in the ring, buddy. I feel bad for Cesaro. He's getting pummeled. You know, so is so is Gable. Oh, the elbow to the face. Oh, oh, the punch to the eye, the eye rake, the eye rake, and now Cesaro going for the cover. One, two, three, and Cesaro picks up the victory against Chad Gable due to the, the cheatness of Cesaro. What a hell of a match we had here on Monday Night Raw. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for our next matchup. Ladies and gentlemen, this matchup is for the WWE number one contendership for Goldberg's WWE title at Survivor Series as been announced. As been announced that Matt Hardy got traded to to SmackDown for the Viper. Now Randy Orton looks to become the Raw WWE Championship champion. I'm in botching all day, guys. This Alright, this is just out of character for a moment. This is like my fifth or sixth time recording this matchup because I keep on messing up. So, uh... So, yeah, just let you guys know. If I goof up, that's that's my bad. Alright, back in character. Alright, and here we go. Oh, big Tilt World backbreaker. Now, remember, Goldberg let me book the show here tonight. He's like, you know what? We're in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Book, book the show. Go ahead. So, I this is my book show. Oh. Oh, no. The Randy Orton backbreaker. Oh, the stomps. Oh, and another Randy Orton backbreaker. Stomps, stomps, stomps. Oh, and a Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn, man. 
He has been one of the most underutilized guys on Monday Night Raw. Oh! But look, he's be here to become the face of the WWE. He wants to win the WWE title for true reasons, not to be egotistical like Rand, like, not Randy Orton, more like, uh, what's his name? <laughs> Goldberg. You see, I don't, when I was general manager of Raw, I didn't hand myself a title. I didn't hand the people I liked a title. But, what you gonna do? Oh no, the Viper is setting up for it. RKO, no! Blue Thunder Bomb to the Viper! One, two. Oh, the Viper just kicked out. Now, Sammy. Throws him into the other corner. Oh, in the other corner. Throws him outside of the ring. And Sammy saying, Shots on! <laughs> and now Sammy Zayn. What could Sammy Zayn be going for? Oh, he throws him in. Oh, the big punch to the corner. Oh, another one. Hello, the kick. No, oh, Randy Orton counters. Randy Orton counters. One, two. Oh, he just kicked out. And now the Viper is setting up for it. What well, the vintage Orton DDT? And now, the Viper setting up for it. Again, to RKL, no! And now Sami Zayn throws him into the corner. A big exploder suplex. One, two. Oh, the Viper just kicked out. And you see the Viper. Now he's getting all this anger out. Oh my god, he's like so angry. Remember, the winner of this matchup will face Randy Orton. Or not Randy Orton. <laughs> will not face Randy Orton. We'll face Goldberg at Survivor Series. Oh, the stomps. The RKO hasn't worked yet, but what about the pun kick? Go for it. Big, oh, the pun kick. One, two. Oh, Sammy Zayn kicked out. No one has ever kicked out of the pun kick. Oh, the uppercut. And now the Viper is setting him up. No. Sammy Zayn got her. Hello, the kick. Cover. One, two. Oh, the Viper just kicked out. And Sami Zayn. And Sami Zayn now. Those are into the ropes and the drop kick. Oh, the drop kick. Rolls through into the big neck breaker. Now Sami Zayn sets him up for it. Oh, no. I thought he's going for that. That vicious. 
Oh, the vintage blue thunder bomb. And you see the viper. Oh no, Sami Zayn! Oh no! Oh, and a big off the ropes. Roll through. Oh no! Oh, the big clothesline! And you see Sammy heads up to the top rope. Sweats on! He heads to the other rope. Oh, oh okay. You should have gone up a second time, Sammy. One, two. Oh, Sami Zayn kicked out. Sami Zayn, the heart of a warrior. And now you see the Viper. Oh, Sami Zayn fights back. Sami Zayn fights back. He's going for the cover on Randy. One, two. Oh, the Viper just kicked out. And Sami with a big... Brain Buster! One, two, three, and Sami Zayn defeats Red Yarden! The referee did not ca catch! Red Yarden's hand on the rope. Sami Zayn is the number one contender. We'll finish Goldberg at Survivor Series. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for our main event. And here we go. It is time for the main event. Fellow contest is going to be a fellow for the United States to be a tip. Yeah, you heard it right. Curtis Axel is getting the opportunity of his lifetime. He gets a shot. At the United States Championship. Yes. Curtis Axel. Versus Finn Balor. Now you see it's me. It's me. It's Brett. I had to run down the ringside as Dirty Deeds is doing. Ma managing. Curtis Axel. You know, give him advice. Help out the kid. You know. And Finn Balor looks to start off this match extremely strong with a power bomb. One, two, three. I'm kidding. It's only two. <laughs> you guys actually think I'm serious, don't you? Oh, the Axel though. Axel, he stated that he is fighting for his father. And a big German suplex. Well, oh, to Finn Balor, man. He realizes that Curtis Axel is not that big of a challenge to, to, to him, apparently. He thinks that Curtis Axel is nothing. But, you know what? Curtis Axel, I hope you win this match. Oh! And Axel now. Oh, that big DDT. Go for cover on Bala. One. Oh. Oh, the big punch from Balor. Oh, the spinning backhand. And again, he's doing it. Big sit down power bomb. Good. I'm sorry, but 
Axel, but good night. Oh, Axel just kicked out. And Axel and Finn Bala. They're similar to Jericho's code breaker. And he said not I think I know what he's setting up for. He's going for it. Nineteen sixteen to Axel. Cover one. Two. Oh Axel kicked out. Oh Axel kicked out at two. Who would have thought that he had it, had it in him? And now Finn Balor. Oh no, he moved out of the way! And Axel! Going for it! Box breaker! The neck breaker, oh my god! Oh my god! Axel, Axel, Axel! One! Two! Damn, Axel has defeated! Finn Balor! Axel is somehow defeated Finn Balor. Oh my goodness. Right here, I thought it was over in 1916. Axel. I thought it was three, but... But, but right here, the cover one, two, was not enough. But it was right here. Axel was able to defeat Finn Balor clean. And you see, Axel in the middle of the ring. Ballard lost the United States Championship to Curtis Axel. Man, that was a hell of a show. I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, wait. The screen is frozen for you guys, but Axel rolls into the ring. And Ballard is now inside the ring. And he oh, here comes Goldberg. Goldberg. Goldberg's entering the ring. Spear! A spear from Goldberg! What the hell? What the hell? And a jackhammer! That's what you get for losing the United States Championship, you son of a bitch. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. Goldberg has sent his message.